Hi and welcome to our next video. This video will be all about how to set up our profit percentage and our break even point. I'm about to explain about that. But before we do that, I would like you to put some details here. After we uh, register to the B Global Price Monitor, here we have the home page over here. I want you to go to your account. And here, under personal information, please fill your details, your first and last name, your phone number. You do not have to use the Skype, but if you have it, that's great. Country. Make sure the PayPal here is correct. And name on the invoice would be for tax purposes, for your own purposes. Actually, do submit all changes and we can continue to our next step. The next step would be to go to the area where it's a price monitor and here please go to price monitor configuration click on the small triangle over here and here you are about to see few things first make sure it's synced to eBay make sure supplier is B global and let's talk about percentage to break even what does that number here means okay as you all know we are about to sell our items on eBay when I take an item and I sell it on eBay eBay charges me a final fee okay a final selling fee I add it to the uh, as a text two links that you can see the eBay fees very easily one of the links is for an eBay store as you can see over here by categories and one of the links is for a user right now we only opened an eBay user account we haven't subscribed for an eBay store yet but that's okay this is great for our start okay but very soon we are about to upgrade our user into a basic store as you can see here basic premium or anchor store but right now we are here now look at that standard fees for most categories is 10% maximum okay once for books it's 12% once we will be an eBay store we have 9.15% for most of the categories okay some categories more and some categories less so I take eBay as 10% fee uh, final value fee percents of the total amount of the deal now let's go back to our monitor the percent to be break even let's say if I sold something for a hundred dollars and eBay took the ten percent ninety dollars it's what I have left in my pocket but this is not actually accurate because I have to include the PayPal fee as well PayPal fee for US account on the first step of, uh, of fees it's around 3% which means 13% out of the sale if I sold it for $100 I will remain with $87 this is where I need to see that the product that I sold for $100 did not cost me more than $87 if I sold it for $87 I, I haven't done anything and if I sold it for more let's say if I sold it for ninety dollars that's okay I gained three dollars on this deal so what here the price monitor do it actually protects me from losing money okay so here the percent to break even as we said usually ten percent on eBay and three percent on PayPal it's thirteen percent I always define here fourteen percent fourteen percent and I'm well covered this would be my break even to the price after I will bring an item from the catalog from the big global website it will be clear for you and you will be able to set it to see it so now I set it up for 14 automation type make sure it's V and fixed to profit and here please make sure no stock GTC which means good till cancelled quantity zero has to be quantity zero please press configure and we are good to go with our protection of 14 percent 
I would like to make this point clear one more time. What is these 14% over here? There are two places that we put percents. Okay, here it's percent and in the second location can be dollar wise. But let's talk about percents for a second. The percent to break even, the $14 percent, is the percents I need to overload on my final price in order to become break even. I will repeat, the percents to break even, when I set it up here for 14%, I calculated 10% for eBay and another 4% for PayPal, and these percents are the percents that I need to add to my final destination price in order to be break even in order to be break even which means still no profit the second place that I'm about to show on the next video when we will upload an item to the price monitor and to eBay actually is will be how much money I want to gain so again we have the 14 percent here which going to be the percentage to be break even and on top of that I will add my percents so what the price monitor will do price monitor eventually will give me my final price now I'm going to explain that with a simple calculator okay let's say that I buy a product from B Global for sixty dollars now let's say that I would like to gain 10%, which means $6. So I need to add $6 here. What means I need to have $66 left after I sold the product on eBay and after I paid eBay and PayPal their 14%. This is where our 14% go in. Now, you do not need to do this calculation. This is why the software is so great, but I just want to show you how it works. I take the 66 and I do double with a hundred, which will give me 6,600. And then I divide this number within the 14%, which means I will divide that hundred less 14. I divide it by 86. This will be my destination price, $76.77, which means if I will take this number, $76 within 76.744 cents, and I will take out my 14%, I will do double zero 86, I have my price of $66. This is what I wanted to stay with within my pocket this is the calculation so here we put our percents to break even and on the next screens when we will start to import the items I will show you how we add our desired profit I hope you got it right you do not need to learn that and you do not need to learn the exact uh, formula that I used but I just wanted you to understand how we calculating the prices because everything here is super professional and I want you to understand this is the heart the basic of the business how much money I need to stay in my pocket after I paid eBay and after I paid PayPal I hope I made it clear for you I know for some it's not clear yet I know for some it's not clear yet and I am here to answer all your questions again and again and again until you will get it right but the most important thing the software does everything for us I know it will be easy to use well thank you very much for watching my video and see you soon on our upcoming videos how to import the items from the catalog through the price monitor eventually to eBay. Thank you.